Hi there, Virgo, Virgo Sun, Moon, Rising Sign. This is your May 2020 Love Monthly Forecast Reading. And I am currently actually doing this reading for Virgo and towards Pisces onwards during the time of the new moon in Gemini. And it is my hopes that this reading might be carrying over to the energy of the new moon. So whatever information that comes through this reading can be um, of high influence for you for the rest of the month and onwards to um, 30 days onwards. So it will carry over at least until next month, that kind of thing. So um, yeah. So it's going to be a mixed bag with the energy of the new moon in Gemini. So for Virgo, this is actually a very happy time for you. Even though that um, with this reading, it is showing us here that you might have started the month or you were coming to a point. Uh, you're coming from a point of loneliness, a point of sadness, and a lot of reflection in life. There are a lot of things that you have been uncertain about, especially with the matters of the heart. So that is during um, probably the first few days of May or maybe um, the month before May, which is April. Um, there are a lot of disappointments that you have felt or experienced but with the month of may there is like a zest of new energy that is coming for you especially as the new moon in gemini occurs it's like you know maybe you're getting a lot of ideas or maybe you have um you met someone or some form of relationship with someone is going to be developing or is at the process of growing uh, in a more positive state of mind. It shows us here that we have this nine of swords at the bottom of the reading, which is telling us that you have a lot of fears. And yes, we do see here that, you know, there is a possibility that you might be flirting around, dating, dating someone, maybe online, or, you know, maybe you are dating or attracted to someone whom maybe you feel a very close connection with whether you know them recently or if you have already knew them from a long time ago i just kind of feel that there is that you know a sense of belonging kind of energy and there is something in this reading that really makes you feel good um, so even though we do have a lot of Neptune things happening and usually I would say to be careful of this ne Neptunian energy as an astrologer, but with the reading for Virgos, it is giving me a feeling wherein you might just meet someone like a soulmate that can really make you feel good about yourself and it might make you it gives that feeling wherein you you finally meet or met someone that can actually work for you which is a very positive thing so there is a very like you know uh, a sense of falling in love and you know basking in the energy of you know um, the energy of love itself y you can see how positive you can be um, throughout the month it will make you feel as if you know finally happiness has arrived there is that kind of feeling so um, there's a lot of emotions um, being carried over into this reading and even though th there are negative emotions from the past it is showing us here that you are coming to a place of light and a place of love something is growing something is moving forward and you might just get the answers that you need some form of you know something that you that have left you confused in the past finally unlocks within the month of may it could be you know something that has already occurred and for some of you maybe you are about to unlock that chest unlock that closet 
that can actually give you a sense of happiness and security in life. So something that you can you have no control over in the past, something that has scared you, something that you know has made you feel down, is now coming to a point of renewal wherein it is really going to give you a sense of empowerment, especially in terms of love. This whole reading is showing me that you know if you are in a sing you are single for such a long time, um, there is like a huge. Um, percentage that there is someone who is going to be entering your life and maybe they are already in your life already if, as we speak right now this will make you feel that all your hard work all the things the bad things that you have experienced in the past you know you can actually you know forgive and forget them and treat it as a lesson there is a sense of feeling of accomplish accomplishment, feeling as if everything is actually worth it, which is a very, very positive thing. The only thing that is, you know, quite a bit on the negative side into this reading is that, you know, you have a tendency to, you, to be skeptical with things and, you know, your anxieties and worries can creep up here and there. But... Um, this reading is giving you some form of assurance that some form of happiness opportunity for um, a lasting partnership happiness and joy in life can be experienced as a whole you know there is nothing really very shady into this reading it's just that you know there could be some form of communication problems here and there uh, communication awkwardness but um, this can be uh, resolved very quickly, that form of energy, and it is giving you like a push that, hey, it's okay, everything is gonna be okay, and you know, there's going to be something more um, to be experienced with this person in mind, you know, it's not a short-term thing, it can be something that can last a long haul a last a lifetime it's as if you know you if you have been having a lot of problems finding someone who who whom you would want to commit with or whom wants to commit with you finally you you might find someone whom can can actually be worth committing to i would say that kind of thing so you might just you know meet someone that is actually meant for you or like a soulmate connection that is not karmic in a negative way you know it brings good karma into your life so it actually brings you a lot of energy to do more things you know you you get inspired to do a lot of things in a very constructive manner even though we are in a lockdown scenario you know maybe there are times wherein you might feel very down but for the most part i feel that there is a very radiant energy um, coming through for you especially as we go over to the mid month of may onward so this is a very positive reading and it is showing us here that you know there is something that can actually last you know something very strong so a very a significant person can really come into your life at this time and it it gives that vibration as if it's telling us that you know mr right <laughs> has come into your life so it has that form of feeling so i would say that for many of you if you are in a relationship though already with someone then this can be saying that maybe you feel as if you know the relationship has been dying down you feel alone in the relationship then something could be happening within the month of may that revitalize something in the relationship you know giving you a sense of relief from any past worries and anxieties that you have so i don't know how is that going to be manifesting for those that are currently in a relationship but we do see some form of improvement maybe the lockdown that we all have been experiencing for the past few months um have some form of blessing in disguise after all 
that allows you to have a renewed sense of love and rene renewed sense of commitment with your own partner and a lot of talks and communication um, are going to be cleared out as a result so um yeah there is this you know i really see the feeling of feeling happy and marriage and new beginnings seeping through this entire reading so um yeah this is a very positive reading for you guys of virgo so i'm very happy for many of you especially those who have been single for such a long time this could be the time where in you just might you know find someone see someone or it could be a start of your happy days ahead um i don't know for whatever reasons um this could be but it's telling us that there is good luck here and there is a new beginning and something feels really worthwhile is coming through so um yeah thank you guys for watching and tuning in with me and if you want a more personal and detailed reading specifically for you and your own situation you can do that but booking a session with me through my website in the stars by and i shall see you guys again next month